Hospital, the medical director of the Greater Accra Regional Hospital, Dr. Emmanuel Strofenio, says it appears there is shortage of surgical masks and gloves on the local market. Speaking after receiving some non-medicine consumables used to fight coronavirus from the Universal Hospitals Group and NS Chemist, he also stated that four COVID-19 patients at the hospital are in stable condition. We'll hear from him shortly. But first, here is Chief Executive Officer of the Universal Hospitals Group, Frederick Emisa, who is appealing to corporate institutions to come together to help fight this pandemic. We have only one Ghana. This is all we got. With this global pandemic, you basically see everybody where they come from. And this is what we have. So I'll tell all industry, all corporate players, all individuals, that whatever your widow's mind is, one CD, two CD, a prayer here, a prayer there, we're all in one ship and we're going to do this together. And I believe and trust in our medical team, the Ghana Health Service, the Ministry of Health, with the confidence that the presidents address the nation, we know we're going to fight this pandemic and come out good. A critical for me is some masks, oxygen masks, some sanitizers and hand gloves to help the frontline staff of the Greater Accra Regional Hospital do their work diligently and with the knowledge that they are safe and there's a community support from companies like we do. It falls into our values as a company to support the communities that we work in. And we certainly support all our medical staff and those at the front lines are doing a great job, but they can use all of the help in the world. Well, let's hear from the medical director of the Greater Accra Regional Hospital, Dr. Emmanuel Strofenio, talking about shortage of the items they need on the local market. And only talk for those patients who are under our care at the Greater Accra Regional Hospital. But as far as the patients who are within the Greater Accra Regional Hospital are concerned, I can say that they are all doing very well and they are recovering and we hope that in no distant future we will be discharging them home. And as we look through the list, these are exactly the items that we needed in large quantities. We are so grateful. And as we all know, fighting an epidemic like this is something that is very expensive and the hospital alone cannot do it and government alone can also not do it. So we really need support of other organizations and it is in this light that we really appreciate the gesture uh, of what the gesture that Universal Hospital Group has just done. To be able to succeed, we need everybody's support. Some of the items are very difficult to get even in the market. Items like face masks, surgical face masks, which we normally use in theaters and also those special masks that we call N95. These have become very difficult to get in the market. It looks like there is shortage in the local market. So we are using this medium to appeal to the general public that whoever is touched, who is in a position to help supply, get some of these items into Ghana and support us with some of these items, we are ready and willing to receive. Dr. Shrofenio, the human resource manager of NS Chemist, uh, one of the companies that also added to the, to the uh, donation, Solomon Ohine Fosu, says it's important for Ghanaians to extend help to Ghana's health service at this time. The situation now, um, as it's in Ghana, requires that corporate bodies who can support should take steed and then also come and then support. NS Chemist is doing this as part of our social responsibility. And now that we are in the industry that this issue has happened, it um, requires us to do just that. And that is what we've done. Yeah. So we presented the um, nose mask, sanitizers, and um, the necessary, um, um, let's say, um, um, products that we need in this time of the COVID-19. Yes. Okay. 